Hi, so you finished your project and you're ready to bind it off. You can see I made just a nice uh, simple rectangle that I'm gonna make into a coffee cozy and I'm going to bind it off now with a, a simple um, bind off. So you know how to knit, so you're going to just knit two stitches just like every other row. Now that, that you have two stitches on your right hand needle, stick your needle through front to back and then you're going to pull this stitch over the top of the other one and off. So I'm gonna show you again, I knit it again. So now I have two on my right needle. I'm gonna pull the back one up and over the top one and off. One more time. I'm gonna stick it through and then I'm going to pull it over and off. Three, I'm gonna stick it through I'm gonna pull it over and off. So you just knit one, and then you pull it over and off. And you do it again and again until you have done this process to every stitch that you had on your needle. And knitting, pulling over and off. You don't have to pull it really tightly. You don't have to worry about things falling off. Just knit until you have two on the right needle. Pull it through over and off. Now I have one stitch left. So normally you just cut this yarn. I'm gonna just break it because it's cotton and it breaks really easy. And you can take a needle and th thread it through or you can just make this loop a little bigger and stick your stick it through with your finger. So you're just going to stick it through the loop just like you were tying a shoe and then gently tug it until it becomes a little knot. And then when you're finished with that, you can use this tra this yarn as part of your your sewing your project together or you can weave it through the strands to make it, um, and then cut off the rest to make a nice clean edge. So there you go. I've bound off my project and I'm all done knitting. Thanks for watching. I'm gonna have more videos, uh, so watch this channel. Thank you.